What's up guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add transition effect in Filmora 13. I'm going to show you how to add this soul transition, fade in and fade out transition, and also how to add white left and white right transition and stuff like that. So this tutorial is designed for a beginner. And if you are an advanced video editor, you don't need to watch this video, okay? By the way, if you want to download the software, go ahead to the link in the description. And if you want to purchase the license of Filmora 13, don't forget to use my 20% discount coupon code in the description. All right, and let's go to my computer screen with a transition. <laughs> okay, and this is my Filmora 13. So I have two video on the timeline. The first one is my talking head video. Actually, I'm playing a uh, games and this is the screen recording or the gameplay. So now what if I want to transition from my video to the gameplay video. So it is very simple in Filmora 13 now. So first up, you need to split the video of me and the screen. Okay, so this is a split. And now you need to go to the transition tab right here. And now find the transition, okay? Transition folder. And you see here, this is fade and this soul. So they offer many fade and this soul transition. By the way, don't forget to change the view option to free one. Otherwise, it will include all the paid one. Uh, we has the pinky diamond button here. This is a subscription service from Wondershare. Okay, just use a free one and I think it's enough. And for this position, we want to find this soul. Okay, so we have the this soul here. Oh, this soul, this soul, this soul. <laughs> and now you need to download this one. So just double click to download it or just click at the transition to see it, to preview it here at the preview window, okay? And next up, you want to drag and drop it right here. For example, you can put it here between the clip. So this is the dissolve transition. That's very nice, right? And you can adjust the duration of the transition by clicking here. And then you can drag this line to the right to extend the duration of the transition like this. And it will happen slower, okay? Okay, so it's too slow. So if you want to adjust the duration, again, you can double click at the transition here or the timeline, and you can change the duration here. For example, normally it would be one second. So this is one second. So you want to press zero, one, and this is a frame. So maybe you can select zero frame. Okay, and you can apply to all. If you have multiple transition on the timeline, you can click here, apply to all. Okay, and now it's just one second, something like this, okay. And if you want to change the type of the transition, you can click here, prefix, overlap, or postfix. But in my opinion, after using Filmora for many years, I don't think we can see the difference here. So normally I will select overlap, okay? So that's all I do for my transition, okay? Something like this, this is a dissolve. And if you want to replace your transition on the timeline. So just click here at the transition to download it. And then you can drag and drop the transition here to replace it. Just drag and drop it right at the position of the transition effect on the timeline. Okay. And now it becomes fade transition. Okay. Nice, right? And now if you want to apply the transition at the beginning of the video or at the end of the video, for example, you want to create fade in effect or fade out effect. You want to do like this, just drag and drop. For example, we can do the fade in for our video. Okay. At the beginning, we want to have a fade in like this. Nice, right? And if you want to have fade out, you can just split it right here, for example and I can delete it. And now we want to have fade out like this. So that's nice, right? So this is how you can use the transition, how you can add the transition and edit the transition in Filmora 13. By the way, they have many transition effects. Okay, so here they have mine, which is the transition effect that you downloaded to your computer. And when you click favorite or this star button, it will be here at the favorite folder. And this is the thing that you download Okay, so this is downloaded folder has many transition and here they have transition and trending fade and this one and zoom and popular. So all this folder will include many transition effect. By the way, they change the folder name all the time from this version to next version. They change it to maybe something like recommended and trending and 
and something like that. So all you need to do is to remember the main folder. It is transition, okay? So this is the main folder. Just remember the transition tab and go to the transition and then you want to find the transition effect in the subfolder, okay? And you can search for the transition also. For example, if you click here at the transition and then you want to search for something like glitch, something like that and you can press enter and there will be many glitch transition effect appear here in this folder okay wait a second okay and you see here we have many glitch effect by the way you have to connect to your internet or you should have a wi-fi to download and to see the transition okay and here we have the audio transition if you want to have transition between the audio you can add to your audio also they have constant gain constant power and exponential fade and also logarithmic fade stuff like that for the audio okay for constant gain and constant power it will maintain the power or maintain the gain of the audio so you don't hear the, the volume go down and go up at the transition position all right so that's all for today's video that is how to add transition effect in Filmora 13. i hope this video is helpful for you if you have any questions just let me know in the comment section below thank you very much for watching and i will see you in my next video goodbye